take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Because they emit carbon monoxide, gas dryers absolutely must vent to the outside. Ideally, electric dryers also should vent to the outdoors. Unfortunately, structural challenges and other issues sometimes make venting a dryer inside of the home seem easier and more appealing, and some landlords may require it. Take our lead. The maximum developed length of a clothes dryer exhaust duct shall not exceed 35 feet from the dryer location to the wall or roof termination. The maximum length of the duct shall be reduced 2.5 feet for each 45 degree, 0.8 radians, bend, and 5 feet for each 90 degree, 1.6 radians, bend. Take our lead. Does running an empty clothes dryer use the same amount of energy as running a full load? It is not possible to say no. The clothes are lifted in the tumbling action by the running clothes dryer. An empty clothes dryer with no clothes requires less energy because it doesn't lift anything. Take our lead. Instead of running through a wall or window, an indoor dryer vent blows into your laundry room, using a filtration system to capture rogue lint. Because the entire system is contained within the home, it is ideal for apartments and condominiums where external venting is impossible. Take our lead. Run a vent hose from the dryer to a window or door leading to the outside. This doesn't need to be a permanent vent line but something you run with flexible aluminum vent hosing to send the heat, lint and fumes outside just when you are running the dry cycle. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.